Right, so here we are in Barcelona. You'll see there's many buildings, people are, are all around, shops galore. This lady loves it. We're having a great time, come on out. There's a guy on a ladder. Well, right now, apparently it's walking up this escalator right here. We are going to our first challenge. The altitude is about plus 5,000. Altitude sickness is real up at the top of this escalator. Yeah. No laughing matter. No. Good morning, guys. We have just hiked up to the top of this little hill and we are about to do our challenges this morning at Park Guell. Are you ready for the first challenge? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Yes! All right, we are here in the beautiful Park Guell, built in 1900 for a playground for the rich and famous. Now is the location of your first challenge. We have hidden 50 of these Barcelona hashtag no regrets in this area and it's up to you guys to go and find as many of these cards in 10 minutes. The YouTuber with the most cards back in 10 minutes time wins a Mediterranean highlights tour for one of their viewers who have registered on kentiki.com forward slash road trip. Let's get ready. Let's Barcelona challenge. Three, two, one, go. Four. I'm doing well, but I don't want to say how many I've got there in my back pocket tonight. Seven, eight, oh, nine, nine. nine. Oh, hey guys, just finished the first challenge of the road trip. I was lucky enough to be the winner, which means one of my viewers, Michelle J from the USA, is going on a Kentucky trip. Congratulations to you! Thanks for voting for me, and stay tuned for more from the road trip. Love you guys. Yes. All right, guys, so uh, we're going to head down back to Barceloneta now, where we're going to have some beach time where you can go swimming. We are going to the beach. We're going swimming because it's hot yeah. out. So uh, we just got off the bus and now we're on our way to go see uh, some flamenco dancers and I'm really excited. You excited? We're excited. We have some earrings for sale for the ears. Here we have the necklace if you have a neck. The button belt buckle. They're all the rage if you have a waist. We're ready for some flamenco. Yeah. All right, so just to give you a little background about why flamenco is so important, it is the most famous and oldest form of Spanish folklore. So the reason it's so famous is because of how raw and how passionate flamenco is. But you need to learn a little bit about how to flamenco. Now, before we go in, you've all got to work on your flamenco face. Now, personally, I think the flamenco face is you staring at the person who you've, who's just cheated on you. So it's kind of like...
full on. I was right front row and they, they were like, I, their sweat was like spraying in my face and it was just like, Wah! it's cool though. Okay. <laughs> that was insane. Yeah, I don't know, I'm just literally <laughs> writing a tweet now saying how is it possible to move your feet that fast? It was amazing. I can't believe how physically difficult that was. I had no idea flamenco dancing was like that. Right guys, so we just finished with a flamenco show. It was absolutely amazing and that officially concludes day two of the Contiki Road Trip 2014. Tomorrow we head off to Nice. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more tomorrow. Found the pine cone, so surprise, I win. <laughs>